I'm ready. So I'm Adam Haley, uh, Director of Product Management at the Genie Industries, and we're here at the Con Expo show, uh, launching a couple of new products. The, uh, the one I'm going to talk about right now is the SX125XC, um, an exciting uh, redesign of our S125 product family, um, and uh, with a bunch of new features, a lot of uh, great improvements to a really popular product line. Um, so I'm going to talk about the 125 XC and then and then uh, also talk about uh, what XC is across all of our products. Um, but starting with the, the brand new SX125 XC, we initiated this redesign uh, to do uh, a few improvements to the overall performance and quality of the, of the machine, but also to address the new ANSI standards that are changing for North America. Uh, the new ANSI A9220 standards requiring uh, uh, some significant changes to how booms work and how uh, operators are going to interact with those booms, and specifically with that load sense requirement. So the ability uh, for the machine to sense the weight in the platform and then shut down the machine if the, the platform is overloaded. <clears throat> We recognize this as a uh, as something that uh, is going to change how operators use the products, and so to address that um, specifically from a from a capability capacity standpoint, we came up with this XC um, strategy to provide an unrestricted range of motion with 660 pounds capacity. That's about 30 percent more than than the industry standard of 500 pounds, um, and then a secondary capacity zone of a thousand pounds. So really great uh, capacity so that people and, and end users can do more work at height uh, with fewer cycles, fewer duty cycles. So specifically on the 125, uh, we do have the new load sense system uh, that we've developed. It's a digital load sense system, really robust, reliable, um, and, uh, and extremely accurate so that uh, we're able to, to understand what's going on in the platform um, and make sure that operators are, are uh, protected at height. The other big improvement was to the range of motion. We changed from a analog style uh, load set, or uh, excuse me, analog style um, range of motion to a digital uh, measurement for a range of motion, so that we can smooth out that envelope. Really provide some good usability and, and uh, operator performance uh, in the boom with a much more full range of motion. Um, the next big changes we made to this machine are the, uh, the design styling. Uh, we're, this is the last of our big booms to receive our, our new design styling, um, which we think is not just you know a great uh, color scheme, but also some good quality improvements. Robust handles and covers, um, strong cover supports, and a really uh, you know, strong uh, positive latching feel on the, on the covers. Um, the final big improvement we made with this machine is with the Mini X chassis. This is the same Mini X chassis that we're using on our SX135 XC, um, and uh, as well as our uh, Z ZX135. Um, big improvement over the telescoping axles that we used to have on the uh, S125. This is actually the last of our products to have those uh, telescoping axles, which caused some issues from a service standpoint. Um, this is really a state-of-the-art X chassis system that uh, we developed many years ago and are, have been making improvements on. Um, excellent performance in terms of its maneuverability, four-wheel steer, four-wheel drive, um, good strong stable base, but then the uh, awesome uh, ability to then collapse down to eight foot two inches so that we've got a, a, a very easily transportable machine. Even though these machines are so big, we, we focus really hard on making sure that they are transportable, no over width or over height uh, requirements, um, and, uh, and we'll fit on, all of these machines will fit on standard trailers. So really great improvements to a, a really important uh, product line for us, and, and we know that our customers are going to uh, see the, the value and the benefit of this, uh, these improvements.